project was called Collaborative Planning Protocol for High Cognitive Demand Tasks. Our goal was to support teacher teams in planning for the implementation of high cognitive demand tasks. Toward this end, we created three products. First, a white paper summarizing the research we did. Uh, second, an overview of the steps of our protocol. And third, a worksheet that goes into detail of each step. We wrote a white paper and structured it to include research about the different topics that we are addressing in our protocol. First, we addressed the idea of co-planning, which we defined, and then spoke about research, which supports the effectiveness of co-planning. The NCTM in particular writes that co-planning is a professional obligation for developing teacher skills. We also highlighted definitions of high cognitive demand tasks and some research which shows that across the world, high cognitive demand math tasks lead to better student thinking. Finally, we included information about survey results. We took a survey of all of the teachers in the PL working group at PCMI Summer 2018. Teachers in our survey had an average of 8.7 years of teaching experience, and 85% reported experience co-planning with someone else in their department. These teachers agreed that they would like to spend more time talking about co-planning, particularly when it comes to discussing the mathematical tasks at hand. Our protocol tried to acknowledge that teaching teams have finite time together, and as such, we wanted to prioritize the steps we thought were most important. Uh, so our protocol starts with the team trying the task and actually doing the mathematics, making sure that everybody's on the same page. Uh, second, we focus on refining the task with a lens towards engagement and then differentiation. Uh, as teams get more comfortable with this protocol, this overview can be used as a sort of checklist um, rather than going into detail. The worksheet is broken into five sections. Using the task, the collaborating teachers will do the math while reviewing different strategies, the goal of the task, as well as highlighting its appropriateness. At the end of each section, there is room for action steps. The next section is refine the task. Collaborating teachers will think about the hook, whether or not this task can be modified to make it culturally relevant, reflect on the intellectual need of the task, as well as the intellectual demand throughout the task. As collaborating teachers are planning, they should consider what students would benefit from adjustments to the task that would make it accessible and meaningful to all students. Collaborating teachers should review the steps in this section to prioritize which topics if not all, they should discuss together. This protocol is designed to be used by all possible collaborative teaching teams. You will have the opportunity to reflect on the co-planning co process and the lesson results.